hi in this lecture we will learn that how we can uh, prepare our uh, protein structure in the previous le lecture i just told you simple method how you can prepare your protein and get active side so if you move toward a professional side so there's some other steps to perform so uh, I, in my previous lecture i already uh, recorded that how you can download your protein sequence for from database and your ligand ligands from database ligand is also your drug so here we just um, download the data uh, protein by id directly with the help of discovery studio so i write here 3 r z a and open it 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 will give me a uh, structure of my protein okay so first move toward preparation of protein you need to delete some things from your protein structure so extra molecules from your protein delete it hetero atoms delete it and ligand groups uh, is also need to remove from it so you know you have a a chain and active site and some other protein groups so next step is that to check that our protein have some uh, rough structures or not so why we click here on your protein and get a protein report if you check a protein report you can see here there is a purple sequence in the beginning and this purple sequence is also present in the ending so it is basically your start and uh, stopping part so if these sequence are present in between your structure of protein so it's mean that you have some invalid and distorted structure of protein so therefore we need to prepare our protein so first we prepare it close this part and click on your protein Mm -hmm. and click on prepare protein and click prepare protein put here some sequence here and in parallel processing you always choose true and run this in the background i already prepared its structure so it takes some time do you can see here our protein structure is prepared here Review when you click on review your result, you will see the structure of protein. See, you can change its display style by click on display style and choose any one which you want. You see here, and now check again your protein structure have some bad sequences, a distorted sequences or not. Click on your protein first and then check in a protein a report protein and protein report now you see it again showing the sequence so close this and again click your protein first and get a protein report now you see sometime if you if you if you did not click on your uh, 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 prepared protein it will again give you the same result so first need to click on your prepared protein and then check the report now you can see here in a chain there is no purple sequence these are just present in, in the beginning and present in the end so our protein have some bad sequences we just build it and make it stabilize so next step is that you need to run for a simulation mean to minimize its energy to make it more stable for a molecular docking so we click on a run simulation and click on minimization in minimization you need to input type typed molecule mean your prepared molecule you will put it here minimization there is two step in minimization here if you check that algorithm is smart minimizer you if you want get a more stable protein structure you need to perform two time two type two time uh, minimization first one is a, a steep at a steep steepest descent click on it and and on advance click on it everything is okay and run 
and put it on a background after some time it will give you a result now our result is prepared so it's pretty fast you no need to wait more time click on your minimized molecule it will give you some kind of a result you can check it and again click on a view result the molecule which show in your window is your first minimized molecule so again click on your molecule on your window and again minimize it in the second time what will you do second time you need to minimize with the help of gradient conjugate gradient so click on it and run again and put it on your background so this is a second step of minimize why we perform two type of minimization after two type of minimize minimization your protein structure will be more stable more stable so you can use it in and get a good result when you dock with the ligand so our structure is prepared to after two time and minimization you can see here this is your protein structure see you can move it with the help of mouse and put it in front of you okay this is your basically a uh, finalized structure so what you need and other things uh, you need a ligand for a ligand molecule you need to first get its structure from different websites like zinc and drug bank and again two type of minimization we done with with the help of this minimization method to make our ligand molecule more stable so how i will perform here so get its molecule your interest of drug mean your ligand molecule so i have i have i have trimers align i click on it and it will give me a it's a structure molecule this is my ligand or drug molecule so what will you do it to click on small molecule tab and minimize like it click on full minimization and again perform two type of minimization first one is steepest descent and run after some time it will give you uh will give your result so it will give us our result here minimize like and click on it and view result this is your newly prepared first time minimize again click click on your uh, window and full minimization and again put here a conjugate gradient and parallel processing will always be true and run and after some time it will give you and it will confirm you your given pose is minimized and stabilized it will help you in a molecular docking process so our uh, second time minimized ligand molecule is prepared so our ligand is prepared and our protein is prepared so in the next step we will learn that how we can dock these two, two molecules and what will be the protocol of the molecule and how we can find the binding site so comment in my video if you have any query about the video thank you very much